Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be reviewing the new Osnap 3 Pro. So they made some changes on it. This is what it looks like now. It is magnetic and it is also adhesive assisted. So let's go ahead and open it up and take a look. So the Snap 3 is much thinner than the Snap 2. It is uh, compatible with the MagSafe. So I won't remove the sticker part and you'll see that it still sticks as a magnet. So the reason why they made it so thin is so that you can still charge without removing it. See that? It still charges. Problem is, if it's just using the MagSafe, whenever you pull this out, it would pull off the Osnap 3. To prevent that, what they did was they used an adhesive so that you remove this and it has a sticky pad, which is you can remove and reuse so it's not permanently stuck on the phone. I'll go ahead and remove it here. And you, if you have a MagSafe compatible, you don't even have to line it up in the center. All you have to do is just let the magnet do its thing. So you just kind of find the magnet and it sticks on there. So we just apply firm pressure for a little bit. I also applied one on my MagBack case. So it does stick onto the case and it also still charges it even though you have a case. So we'll test that out in a little bit. As you can see, it's pretty thin. Uh, it's actually way thinner than the, the camera bezels. When you put it down, it's actually pretty flat against the camera. So this is actually sticking out a lot more. So it's very thin. Now for this, they made some changes on the stand. So you just pop this part open and this is what it looks like inside. You would slide your finger in like that. Okay. It is pretty comfortable. It does rotate. And then to put it back in, you just simply push it in and it clicks in. Now, I don't know how durable that's going to be, how long it's gonna last, you know, by opening and closing it multiple times. But it seems pretty durable and it is pretty comfortable. Now, if you want to use it as a stand, you have to pull it out this way and then tilt it, put it against that center, and then it becomes a stand and just rotate it this way. Okay, you can also use it as a stand vertically like this. Let's try out that charger, see if it'll get pulled out, still charges. So with the adhesive, it stays on the phone, it doesn't come off, so it's pretty strong. Okay. So you don't have to take it off every time you need to charge it. And it's removable, so you can just simply peel it off. You can reuse it and restick it again if you want to put it back on. Now they said that if you do lose some of the adhesive, all you have to do is just rinse it with warm water and alcohol, wipe it with alcohol, and let it dry, and it should be sticky again. Now we'll try it with the case. So this is the same Snap 3 Pro, just in the black color. I'll go ahead and put on the case. All right, so let's try it with the charger. Okay, so it does charge. As long as your case is not too thick, then it should work. So I think it's an improvement from the Snap 2 where you always have to, you couldn't charge it and it's much thicker. Um, the only thing that I would be worried about is uh, the durability. I don't know how long these, these plastic parts are gonna last. So that's the Snap 3 Pro. 
um, which I think it's a very nice improvement from the previous models. All right, thank you for watching. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and like this video.